Hey you guys, it's Jerusha. You're watching Jerusha to a TV. Who wants favorites? Me, 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 me. Woo, 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 woo. <sighs> Way too much coffee today. Back with May favorites. May, as in the fifth month of the year. Not as in May favorites, like a real southern accent or something like May. Whoa way too much coffee for the day and I'll just have me some more ah, that's a good drop a little bit too much coffee today I'll tell you where that came from I saw a really big guru's favorites videos for May come up and I just was like May why is she saying my like M Y? like I just read it really quickly so it looked like my favorites and I just I was like why is she doing my favorites when it's May and then I was like oh it's my it's cray. Getting straight into this favorites video, no bibbly babbling too much. As you can see, my background is a nice golden yellow. We have zero sunlight this afternoon, so I have it on an outdoor fluorescent setting on my camera. I apologize for that. My actual closet isn't yellow, it's just glowing up yellow, so it looks lovely and suntanned in the back there, all my vuittons. Okay, try again way too much coffee first up item I want to tell you about and you guys know I don't do straight-up beauty favorites um, I it's all decor and fashion and beauty all mixed together so that's what my favorites is about this is the cutest antique um, jar these are called apothecary jars um, that my mum got me up near where my mum and dad live there's a lot of antique stores out there they live in the country and she got me this beautiful lidded antique jar for my uh, bathroom to put any of my toiletry needs in it or you know like cotton wool buds and things of that nature but instead I put my baby lips down inside there so cute so colorful we're going on seven baby lips right now this is really just one of my favorites of the months because I can just reach in there grab my baby lips and it's just easy access to get at them we are going into winter as you know here in Australia so I get quite chapped lips um, dry lips over the winter season and so does my husband I try to give him so much purple ointment but true to form he loses it all the time so sometimes I catch him hands in the cookie jar getting out my baby lips uh, problem can you imagine a six foot three man putting on baby lips like the bright pink one I catch him in the bathroom like putting on baby lips hello gorgeous I think he actually enjoys it you know what men these days they love to be groomed put a little bit of makeup on you know I couldn't go past it fashion item LV alert I could not go past it this is my multicolor clay you saw my unboxing a couple of videos ago it is just a true addiction of mine if I'm not using it during the day it's probably just down inside my purse because I like to get it out and look at it strangely we'll just be sitting there having coffee coffee and I'll just pull it out and start looking at it I'm pretty sure my mother and my husband are like what is she doing but I'll just look at it it makes me so happy the colors are actually so amazing but this is my beautiful little clay and it's definitely in my faves list Uh oh I could not go past this I obviously just totally raved about these in my last video but I had to show you right now we have them in a not very attractive situation this is one of my vases and this is rice in here because I needed to instantly stand them up in a um, in a display sort of way so I could use them and this was the only way I could think of at the time if you guys actually have you know links or places where you buy you know obviously don't say places like Michaels or Walmart because I'm in Australia and that's right I can't just nip over there to the States to buy a makeup holder but if you guys know of a site or a link where they have these and they're quite good and you know they have the beads inside that hold them list it below let me know uh, because I'm after one 
I'm happy to buy it online if you're in Australia and you know maybe sort of Howard storage or something but these things are great um, sorry makeup holders are great to hold your brushes these are a fave of mine this month I just raved about them one of my subscribers and followers mentioned that I should have told you about the fact that it's pixie woo it's um, Samantha Chapman that does these brushes I did actually mention that in the video but I cut it out because the video was just as you could see crazy I mean I've had a lot of coffee this video but that video I was just so hot those bloopers were manic because I literally was overheating in here was crazy next up here real quick little one this is another makeup item but this is from a drugstore this is from Priceline and it's the L'Oreal Paris color juice so shiny this stuff is so friggin shiny it's not sticking gacky it doesn't get stuck in my throat you guys know I hate that um, it smells beautiful as well. It's not too potent. It's called Berry Blast is the flavor. It's 220. Colette. Okay, Colette Heyman is um, an Australian brand. It's online. I've blogged a lot about them on Instagram. I have bag charms of theirs. I have clips of theirs. I have little hair items of theirs. Um, and I just love them. Anyway, so this is a Colette bag. I love it because I love the size of it. It's also faux leather so I can, you know, pop it down on the ground or just kind of be a little bit more rough with it. It's got a side zipper there. It's got the studs, the pyramid studs on the back. It's got this top handle which makes it easy. Put it over your arm. And it's got a long body strap as well. You can cross body it on a long length but I just wear it on my shoulder like so. And the inside to this bag is just mage. The lining is this leopard skin type sateen lining it's got the two pockets there I keep my phone and my clays in there and then down inside it's got so much space for all my stuff but still being sort of a medium sized bag so I don't feel like I'm carrying around a massive kind of boho bag and it's not too small either okie doke now up to my last two things and the next ones is hair care so this is all my hair. I'm getting a few inboxes asking me, especially on Facebook, that's so interesting, if this is all my real hair, and it is. I don't have any weaves in, I don't have any extensions, nothing is clipped into this. This is all my hair. It is come back in a vengeance. I'm so happy, as most of you know. Actually, a few of my old videos have just, my YouTube is spazzed out. I'm really sorry for that. And some of my old videos have just uploaded, re-published um, themselves. And there's like six that have come back from 2010 and 2011 when I first started YouTube, when I had my bob. And everyone's like, oh my god, you cut your hair. No, I will never cut my hair again. I'm pretty sure I will die with hair that is like, uh, I can tuck it into my undies. Okay, so in order of how I do this, I get out of the shower, my hair is cleanly washed, I put in my Moroccan oil, and I only put in a 10 cent coin, mainly from here down in all the length, because I don't like Moroccan oil anywhere near my roots. I find it sticks and it's really oily and it undoes everything you've just washed out of your hair. Then I put in my KMS California heat protectant spray. I like this. It smells really nice and it's just kind of like a light mist and I just put that through. Then I blow dry my hair and if I can be bothered, I straighten it. I don't particularly straighten it every day because sometimes I just don't care. And then I put in my Pantene Pro-V Night Miracle Essence. This is so funny. I've done a product rave on this a while ago, a couple of years ago. I still have this stuff and I love it. And technically, I guess you should put it in your hair at night, but I love the smell of it. It smells like you've just come out of the hair salon, so it makes me feel really fresh and just great for the day. And then lastly, I've just picked up Sun Silk's Co-Creator Expert Perfect Straightener. So this is a spray serum that you just spray all the way through. It kind of smells a bit like Fix Plus from MAC except I don't get it in my mouth and you just spray it through and then either with your hands or your brush you just brush it through and it's another sort of one of those serums sprays that smell amazing and it's a straightened style easy and fast anytime anywhere keeps your hair beautifully aligned all day long Ding. and last up on this favorites I picked up brand new bottles of my favorites perfumes at the moment, this, well, I haven't really used this before, but I got it for my mum 
whenever I'm at their house, I tend to spray it. And I actually really like this. If you're a... If you're a kind of musty, but musky, but florally scented gal, Intimately Beckham by Victoria Beckham is really amazing. It's very, it's very like whimsical and beautiful. Really, go out and smell it. Plus, I'm an absolute sucker for any perfume that's got a pink, kind of pink dye to it. I don't know why. That's a really bad way to buy perfumes. As you all know, I live and drink Angel for breakfast. I, I, I just bathe in this stuff. It's crazy. It is just ridiculously expensive to use the refills, and I've been refilling my refills for so long, and I don't know if I just never noticed what I was paying, or maybe there's a price increase or something, but it was like, this in David Jones is $90, and this is the 25 mil. To refill it, the 25 mil refill, which I have the bottle of, is $80. So really, it's a $10 difference to just refill it. So I ended up finding it on sale at Chemist Warehouse. They were having a massive sale. So I just picked that up, and it ended up being like $39, which is crazy for Angel. And it came with this little baby one. So cute. Look at that. It could just fit in my purse, even though I have so many of these purse angels. It's cray. This is a little 5 mil star. So cute. Couldn't you just put that in your pocket? Picked up a Gucci Guilty at Chemist Warehouse as well on sale. Again, I think this thing was like $39. It is a maze. This is the most rich, diva, fierce perfume. If you've never smelled this, go out and smell it because my god, it's just like gold. Well, it is gold packaging, but everything's just gold and gold and fierce. Love it. It's actually how Gucci should smell. They should spray the whole shop that smell, and that is exactly what Gucci smells like. Hmm, I think that's everything. It wouldn't be a Jerusha video if I didn't mention Instagram. I mean, truly. It's just, it's actually, maybe it could be a sickness. Hashtag me, Jerusha Addict, to show me any of your favourites. Definitely, thank you to everyone for showing me their bags. People are just showing me anything that's going on. Any, any luxury brands, I'm loving it. Hashtag me, Jerusha Addict, so I can talk to you on Instagram and I can see what's going on in your collection. Thank you so much for watching. Shout out to my girl, Mel. Mel and I are besties. We're having a love affair. She was so funny in her last video. She shut the hateration down. I literally lost my shit when she dropped a C-bomb on YouTube. I lost it. It was absolutely hilarious. Check out her video. I will link it below. Thank you all so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Thumbs up for favorites. Hope everybody is doing really well. Take care, guys. Peace.